that weekend. Oh shit! Damn. What's up? Something happened to you. Let's go. That weekend, you decide to go with Polly, Vera, Damien, Liam, Worf, and Sin. Ha! Ah, fuck what you, Shinny. Man, we we the you crew. Invited. <laughs> we the crew. Yeah, bros before holes, right? Maybe. Damn. You have a great time at the very popular nightclub, Apollo. Thus named because despite being the hottest club on the weekends, it is an actual temple to the god, Apollo, on the weekdays. <laughs> but no no good party ends with the nightclub closes, so at 6am you decide to just hang out in a nearby park, drinking and chatting. What a rad night, huh? You betcha, Vera and I had some great laughs and some good ol' anal bleaching. What? Whoa. What? Does a shadow demon even have an anal cavity? Maybe. Sure. Like a ghost? Or sure. A I, I felt that. <laughs> I felt like, that answer. You totally, uh, you're totally vibing with that. <laughs> <laughs> Liam right now, just like, the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> Liam's everyone right now. <laughs> it's a game we have. You know, those douchebags that, that steal your drink when you leave it unattended for two seconds? Sure. <laughs> we drink half our glass and then pour bleach into it. <laughs> <laughs> if people are cool, then the club staff just takes them and throw them in the trash after a while. But if someone wants to play smart, then we fucking bleach those assholes. <laughs> Thus, you know, bleaching. Ah, makes perfect sense. That's very funny. Metal. <laughs> Remind me never to get on your bad side, you two. Anyways, what should we do now? Know any cool after part? I think that douchebag mummy said something about an after party at some nearby catacombs. Oh, but remember, he got bleached. <laughs> right, then I have nothing. But this can't be the end without a wacky situation that forces one of our friends to make a hard choice <laughs> that leads to an absurd outcome. No sooner <laughs> Liam has finished his thoughts Finish his thought, then a cloud of mystical green smoke appears from nowhere, and the groovy bearded guy emerges from it. Hey, kids, my name is Joe the Laser. Hey. <laughs> the, oh, okay, you want to do it, Joe? <laughs> I'm like Go for a it. laser wizard, and today I have a quest. The quest of teaching you how to properly dance to a hit song. Here we Here go. We go. <laughs> So, do you remember the classic early 2010s staple party rock anthem by LMFAO? Who doesn't? Today I'm going to teach you how to laser shuffle to it. One of you, come demonstrate the shuffle. Hard pass. I'm more of a, a vogue girl myself. Meh, I have no problem dancing with strangers with magic powers and parks. Also, shuffling is kind of my thing. Damien plays a song on his phone while Polly does some dope ass shuffling, and the wizard syncs his an arrangement of later with her so crazy that with her so crazy that pigeons start falling out from nearby trees. Just wow. Wow indeed. My fellow young uh, young strangers, and so my quest is to pass this knowledge on to you. But who can on take who could take on such an important bird? Unfortunately, at that moment you were smelling at your own armpit and your <laughs> and your hand. Oh, this yeah, should be you. This should be you, Alan. Unfortunately, yeah, at that stuff. moment you were smelling your own armpits and your hand was raised, so now everyone is watching you. Fortunately, you're pretty decent at shuffling, but whose whose laser magic will best complement your dance? Oh, damn. Uh, I do want to say, she's, uh, that character Sin, right? She's already lit enough. She is an Ifrit. So I want right. a, a chance to shoot fire. Laser magic skills are pretty strong, 
that he got banned from the local laser tag place. <laughs> <laughs> I do Damn. I do laser tag How all the time. You? How dare you get banned from a laser tag place? Uh, dude, I don't know. I was so strong, bro. So what? Does this like boost? She got so mad. You <laughs> have to choose which one of your friends you would like to have a bonus. Which one of you? Is this for the fun one? Is this a fun I'm not bonus? I'm fight for it. Because it's your decision. Is this a fun bonus? Who knows? But I'm not fighting for it because it's his decision. I'm falling. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall. It, um, stay. I hope it's a fun bonus. Still. It's smart. Dang it. <laughs> and so the two of you start having a very weird and specific laser base party ritual. Your shuffling kicks ass, and Worf's laser magic is just too strong. <laughs> it's so strong that this event won't be included in the Japanese version of the game to avoid giving kids seizures. <laughs> oh my gosh. God dang. <laughs> Whoa. Porygon. This is otherworldly. You know what? I agree. One fucking hundred percent. What a massive, masterful and splendid display of laser magic. You are the chosen one, <laughs> says Joe the laser. Yes, Joe says Joe's the chosen one. I have He's to review something one. to you. That's right. I was a wizard in disguise. All this time, I was secretly testing you to find out if you were pure of heart and strong of laser. You literally just told us you were a wizard. <laughs> I mean, whatever. Got, I'm got super drunk. But the important thing is, you passed my test. Then what is our prize? Is it seven dolphins? A car? A car made out of seven dolphins? The wizard <laughs> ignores Polly, puts his hands over you and Worf's shoulders, and whispers, The prize is earning the respect of your friends. And now that I found the chosen ones, my time in this world can come to an end. He winks at you and then slowly and emotionally evaporates. Damn, the vapor is infused with a strong smell of cheap rum. <laughs> Did he just die? <laughs> <laughs> we will always remember Joe the Laser. Let's pay our respects by shuffling. <laughs> you, you burst into more awesome shuffling and laser magic. A cheap rum scent. <laughs> oh, it's fun. Hey. Rum scented breeze makes you look at the sky, and there there you can see a cloud shaped like in his face, winking at you. Creepy. Still, you and Worf gain two fun and one creativity. It's like Man, someone died. Better shuffle. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, say what? object. Uh, out loud banana! Or still though. <laughs> Who said what? Is a banana considered <laughs> an object? Yes. Okay, yes. Okay, who said what? I said horse still though. <laughs> I'm gonna say... Oh yes, the Bath and Body Works bourbon lip, uh, the body spray. How are you, Alan? Fun. What? A brick. Yummy. Ah, brick. Player order is decided based on how good the selected object would be as your only weapon. <laughs> I'm Dude, just gonna say right now, man. I think I win. Horse dildo can't. Can horse dildo beat a brick? I'll scare <laughs> you away. The banana. I'll squirt you with stuff. Okay, so. I think I think it's tied between a brick and a banana because radiation poisoning. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't think one banana. And the in the never banana mind. Radiation. Then also, that's not true. There is never. What spider. about if, what if I use my bourbon um, spray as a flamethrower? But Where, that's your how only are you gonna item. light it? From sin, of course. 
Yeah, your hair. Uh, thanks. I'm just, just gonna like, whack you with the horse. Jock- and I'll be like, wow. yeah. Hold we'll, we'll Let me together. see how hard this thing. Listen, Ow, listen. Pain, suffering, dying, help. You all here have set up for like using someone's hair for a flamethrower, or <laughs> having to attach a dildo to a handle. You have to attach it to a handle. Hold up, where is it? Oh, it's all the way in the back. I'll just L- use listen, the small. Listen, amateur <laughs> move. You don't even have lube. No, yeah, don't need it. Hold up. Wait, I hold I up. already have Stickers the away. most optimal weapon here. Oh yeah, can you hear how hard this thing hits against my computer chair? I keep forgetting Wait, you, you have? actually have one. Well, hey, I thought you were a kid and you actually have one? He uh, actually has yeah. No, no, that's a lie. He has multiple. Two. What are you talking? There's <laughs> multiple. I mean, you know what? I hurt myself really bad. I kicked over my books, and now I'm in pain. I sprayed Sheeny. She died. Banana is the greatest. You could penetrate them in many ways in one. I really hope that's not code word. (laughs) No, it's not code word. Just stabbing and dying. Yeah. Horse, Stildo, and Banana are secretly the same weapon. Well, mine's just the actual banana. Is any banana just a dick joke? It's not a dick joke. It's a banana. Because I like bananas. <clears throat> See? Joe gets it. He just ate a banana, right? I ate my spray. Well, that means <laughs> Joe defeated a banana. Yeah, j- dude, just got defeated. You just killed yourself. How'd you... T- <laughs> that- <laughs> It Where's was your yummy. banana now? It's gone. I will no, 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 no! He He's had a out. My banana. He had a banana from his house, but not my banana that I brought to this battle. I'm just gonna chuck a brick at your face. What? You know what? Just you know what? Yeah, that, sure. Yay! Bullshit! <laughs> Oh yeah, shit! It literally reversed the order. It should. <laughs> it actually works out. I'll be right behind you while you spray, and then you you provide the flame. I'm gonna whap you with a horse. <laughs> <laughs> Just swings behind me. How mm. many dodos do you actually have? Too many. Give oh me a number. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yeah, that's a good number. Four. Oh, he's counting. Uh, four, five, maybe. I don't know. Five sounds good. Red. I give up on counting. I'm gonna say five. I that's... I still love how you practically bought that much as a joke. Don't use them at all. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> how much did you spend on it as a joke? Too much. Wasn't it like? Too much. Is it over three hundred? Sure. It's under yes. 500. It's it's no. about five money he has. Uh, I want to know how much money you actually spent on that. Hey, fuck up. <laughs> I'm going to gym. Oh wait, am gym. I... Fucking stop! I'm not doing anything. God damn it! Ow! <laughs> <clears throat> That day, an epic dodgeball match takes place. Amidst the battle, you spot a fellow player that seems utterly discouraged. She thinks she's not worthy... Shit. She thinks she's not worth anything at dodgeball. And she attempts to throw a ball at herself. Explain to her the many ways you think she's unique and wonderful. Also defending the many pleasures in life. I'm dying. Okay, I'm good. (coughs) I need more help. With your help, she's capable of finding reasons to keep playing and gains a sense of self-worth. You gain plus one BFF. Sadly, she's not part of this game, so that beautiful friendship will take place off-screen. And plus two charm. (coughs) On your way out, (coughs) on your way out, you spot Polly still wearing the lab coat she stole from that human party the other night. She takes it off and throws it at you to get your attention. How kind. Thank you very much. (laughs) Yo, yo, yo. That human party convinced me I want to be a scientist, but not just any kind. 
a party scientist. What's a party scientist to ask? <laughs> Why, just a scientist who's dedicated to discovering the secret to the raddest party. Through a series of extremely scientific experiments, I aim to discover what exactly makes a party good. So I can... S <clears throat> so I can distill whatever it is into a violent trinket. Or, you know, just have really dope parties all the time. Anyway, I'm... Go <clears throat> You good? No. Are no. you good? <laughs> no. Anyway, I'm going to a bar mitzvah tonight, and I need your scientific advice. What can we do to push this party over the edge? <laughs> ah! <laughs> These are both amazing. <laughs> oh, I don't know which one I want to pick. I love both of them. Oh. Oh, oh man. Uh. Uh, well, I guess if we're gonna be science, gotta be chemistry. Ooh. Oh, hell yeah. Later that night. Yes, I've done it! I had to tear the heart out of an atomic bomb, but I've done it! I've isolated the element part. Parterium, the life of the party. Now to slip the solution into the bar mitzvah's water supply! The effects are instantaneous. All around you, boys are becoming men! And men are becoming party animals. Not just all around the bar mitzvah, all around the city. The bar mitzvah's water supply was also the city's water supply. You party so hard, you cause serious damage to the local infrastructure. Mayor Grim Reaper declares the next day National Hangover Day. Whoa, what just happened? Oh wait, I remember. Science! Chemical Warfare has never been so fun. You gain plus two fun and plus one smart.